Oh. Good morning. It's time for a bison hunt. Getting ready. Getting dressed. What is it? 620. Let's fold that over right now. See how this goes. Trying to do a little hunting with a broken leg. Ah. First real day of looking for a bison. First real day of doing that. Probably gonna be overdressed, way too hot. You know it says it was gonna be one degree this morning. Let's see. It says it's 19, feels like 13. That's hot. Hot. See the bikes in the picture? There's the fat tire bikes we're going to be riding, hopefully, successfully, today. Oh, always got to put on the camo shirt. Just makes you feel like you're ready to <coughs> go hunting. This is a lightweight shirt. It's not doing me much today. But once you put this shirt on, I feel like you're finally hunting. Takes a full team effort, army, to get things ready at this point. I'd already been loaded early this morning, ready to go. Brazier's gonna text or be over in about 15. I got one hunting buddy early this morning. Two more guys rolling in this afternoon. So if we put something down this morning, and it's on the Forest Service, it'll be an adventure getting ready. Malin, the camera, my man behind the camera again this morning. We got the boys up here in Jackson Hole. Nice little cabin here at the Cowboy Cowboy Village. This is the first time we stay in these little cabins. Works out pretty well. Why is it you always got to hang now when you're hunting? One always pops up the morning of. This is it, Malin. This is it, bud. Finally. You can actually look, or will be looking, for the first time. Truly really hunting for a bison. You just lost where's the bungee. If you were ready, you could text. Right? I'm not ready. You're not ready. No way. Yo, fat tire bikes are out. Okay. It won't take us much to load them up. Close the door. There you go. Whew. Yeah. I'm so geared up here. This is. <coughs> oh, they're loading the bikes up. Loading the bikes and back the truck, I could see. Brazier's out there. Oh, she get one. Oh my gosh. You guys are hard to film with. Sneezy and coffee up there. I get worn out really fast. Mm. Woo. Woo, howdy. Let's try and get this boot on. Man, are these things waterproof? Never worn these pants hunting, so they might be waterproof. Ooh. Got a couple launchers just in case. I got two. Snowshoes are going in the truck. The sleds. Hi. The bike almost didn't fit. It's too long. <laughs> oh, there's the man. Good morning. Dude, look at that camo. You're looking sharp. I got my Badlands on. You got your Under Armors on. Three layers. I got thermals. Warm pair yeah. of hunting pants. And then that on top. And these things, which I've never yeah, worn, which look off. like. I could survive with these, I think. How'd you but guys sleep? Good? good. The, I think the bunk bed on the the wood and everything was a little creaky and whatnot. 
It was all right, but it's just a different. It's bed. the first night all yeah. the time it's in a different new bed. place. It's just yeah. You guys all right? How'd you guys do? I, I slept good. good. I don't think Christy slept too great. I'm though. and surprised that these are very quiet too. <laughs> yeah, you don't hear you nothing. Hear anything. No, you don't hear nothing in these little wood cabins. These pants. Are Looks like they will. Yeah. Well, snap. I didn't know that. I thought they'd be tucked in up here. It's a good deal. Yeah. There, stop. You're going to end up falling and off. That's why I wanted it. these, because oh, look at please. that. I did not think that would happen. I wasn't sure. You but the know. booties I have, we put in the truck already. The boot Where blankets. They? Oh, they might. No, they're right here by you. I saw <coughs> you told me not to oh, yeah. Them. Boot blankets. You can each wear one. I think I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to be the left-footed boot blanket guy like me? Maybe. You may not want that on yet. No. I think it was be way, way warm and it, it might be easier to have you help me put it on. But well, it might be. I'd put it on if I were you. You don't want to be helping him? No, I don't mind helping him, but we might be in a hurry trying to get a buckle. True, that is true. Let's let's try it. Let's just get it on. It ain't going to hurt like nothing. Right I didn't think there was a right or left. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there yeah, is. I maybe think there is. Like that. It looks like it, but they're just brand new, so. We got the right boot, though, so we're. Got that on. Let's <laughs> like loosen that. Okay. Yeah, the only tricky part here is like trying to. God, I got so much clothes on, I can't bend my knee. So we had these on once, we tried it. So hopefully. Now you sent me a picture, I saw it on your foot. It might have been my foot. <laughs> oh, yeah. I put the boot on because I could maneuver it down there. But it's the same size, so I'm hoping. Yeah. I just am afraid to walk your leg. Hang just on. gotta get it over that heel. Yeah, take it off for a second. Oh, I'm hot. I'm hot. Got a lot of stuff on it. <coughs> yeah, we gotta get it shoved in just as far as we can. Maybe that, maybe just shove the toes down as far as you can first before just trying to get over the heel. Yeah, the toe gets on kind of narrow. Yeah. Shove it. There's nothing to pull onto. You're just stiff up here. That should unzip. That's if it unzipped, you'd have it made, wouldn't you? Yeah. Want to go for the hill? I mean, right there. Yeah. Up. Yeah. I'm gonna come closer to me. You yank it. I'm afraid of hurting your leg, so pull it and I'll stuff it on. Anything? It's close. We need to pull this bad big hole. Hurting yourself? I can feel it a little bit. All right, pull. You pull. I want to be more straight up. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> it's just that. This is an XL, like fit size 15. I got a 15 size foot. I'm like 10 and a half to 11. I, I think it'll stretch one. out a little bit. Should have been wearing them in a regular boot, maybe stretch out like that. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> you look like you're going to the moon. Well, we'll throw the AC on and we're the doing. Truck. Oh man, we might be running the air conditioning. <laughs> we'll be the only guys around here. Oh, Windows wait. down, moonroof open. <coughs> That's hilarious. Running the air conditioning. Where's my phone? Oh man. I'm documenting this. Kinoki. <laughs> <laughs> Go. How do you get the bikes out of the back? Oh, that's what I got Brazier for. Brazier put them in <laughs> the reason I came here is yeah. to get the bikes out of the back. That's what I got Brazier for. Oh. Yeah, you almost needed a bigger truck for that. Yeah. Three wheel. Yeah. I think this is, is that the six probably foot about. Bed? I need the six and a half foot bed. Oh, uh, maybe. You need an eight foot, but I think it's about a foot long. Ooh, Longer than that. Yeah, it's long. I didn't even, I thought. No, I didn't think it was Okay, uh, I have to walk around. 
We're sitting here waiting for the sun to come up so we can get some good visibility, glass some of the elk refuge, and see if there's anything sitting over there, any bison. Be cool just to see elk and moose, anyways. Got a pretty sunrise, we'll show that to you. That. I get to be a passenger in my own truck. I got Brazier driving me around, chauffeuring me around today. It's kind of nice. I could actually run the camera for once and instead of somebody else. We're just gonna glass some spots, see what we see. She's already pissed off that people are looking at him. Some mooses. Already seen five moose. Like I said, I think it's just I think it's just cool to always see a moose. I like moose. We spotted our first bison this morning, which are actually on National Forest. Actually on the spot where the National Forest is the farthest away from the road, it it's feels elk. like. Is it elk? Yeah. No! It's elk! The way they looked, they were grouped up and it looked like bison. Well, that makes me feel better because now I don't have to go hiking for it. Take a look over here, look at the beautiful Teton Mountains there. It's a beautiful morning so far, chilly. One, two. Three, and they're just, five, it's just cool. Ten. Ten head. 10 head of elk. They were just grouped up and the way they looked, it looked big. Through binoculars that was. Spot and scope cleared that up pretty quickly. No bulls. Man, my guide over here, he said, that's bison. Jesus, gets your heart rate going. Let's go. <laughs> hey, beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> that's bison, let's go. Hiked over there and would have seen an elk. I've been like, brazier. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me? Cool to see animals anyways. We're up to 11 moose and now we've just seen maybe, I don't know, we got some around 15 elk or so right over here. Well, we found bison, a couple hundred of them, but where everybody says they've, they're at, it's at the Elk Flats, Elk Flat Ranch, Elk Ranch Flats. They're up here. Here they are. You can kind of see some little dots out there. My guide found a found a bracer. <laughs> it's kind of funny, even the bulls out there turn around and look at his park clear over here. They need to move that way. We saw some down here a little farther, a few miles, a couple stragglers, still miles away from the refuge or from any point on the forest service that we could hunt. What? That other one came over and then that one left. That was headbutting the other one. Oh, look at this. He's come up here looking off this car. Getting some salt. Okay, so here we are, the National Elk Refuge. We are gonna give it a go, head out there. It's warm, it's sunny, it's a nice day. We'll see if we can't find one, one. Doing 10 miles an hour.
Yeah, we do. That was a nice gentle fall though. I was trying to get up in here. I wanted to ride it on the snow. <laughs> Did you? I know I want to and I keep hitting a little snow on the side and it kicks me back over. <laughs> Man, how pretty is this? It's awesome. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. You know, I haven't tried. I mean, like you said, like if I go to my left, I could put, a, I could put quite a bit of pressure on my foot. That's why I'm just gonna. Oh, cool! Let's go. We got an elk, dude. Did they hear us? I know I'm doing more time focusing. Whoa, it's bright out here. I was looking up the hill. Look at that elk up there watching us. Yeah. You got your knocks, don't you? Yeah. Oh, did you get some water on them? Yeah. Oh no. I was just gonna say, glance like these shadows, like we just need to make sure. Whew, I'm hot. That kind of sucks. This road goes like way out around that corner over there. Yeah, a little bit of a stronger ankle. I'd consider trying it. Yeah, it might not. So I'll give it a glass over, see if you... We could check that other road out right back over there, I suppose. It might go uphill a little bit. Well, even if the bison hit the refuge hard, sitting right in here would be an idea. I 
I think your bike would go over that though. You might fall. I'm curious. <laughs> I'm curious what this thing could do on that too. <laughs> Send it. Having to work for it. You have to pedal. Man, I swore I heard a howl up there. Why I was on? No, like up there somewhere. I thought I heard like a wolf howl. Oh, that other road looked like it was plowed some. We could check it out. We'll check it out. Yeah, just taking a break on my ass. See anything over there? Uh-uh. Darn, that road goes up the other side of that knob. That's too bad. I like this. This goes a long ways up in here. Oh, we'd be up on top. Of I wonder where this goes up here. I don't know how much battery you got. Um, I'm just over half. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Goes yeah. This goes up here and oh yeah. Probably turn around. Keep going. <laughs> yeah. Get some really cool pics. This thing's a tank, man. Doing okay? Yeah, feel good. I haven't put my feet down for nothing. That's good. There was a few spots where I was like, oh, 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 oh. okay, got it. What's that track? It's not an elk. Cat or, <laughs> cat or wolf. I call wolf. So we're out here on the uh, elk refuge, seeing some elk here and there. Nice five point, six point bull, 500 yards over here. No bison, no bison tracks, no bison sign, but man, look at this view. It's awesome. Today's a pretty warm day here in Jackson Hole. This has just been a lot of fun. So we're gonna head our way back to the mountain though. And, uh, Head back to town, head back to, to the families for the day. But what a beautiful day. Can't beat it unless we saw one bison, one bull bison. So, not today, not today. All right.
I can feel my back tires yeah, your kicking back up. Tire was kicking out <laughs> front's not. See nothing, do you? No. That's about as far as she's going. <laughs> yeah. Coming down the home stretch. Just checking out my monster truck of a bike. <laughs> the brakes are something not to be. Yeah. The back brakes. Right home about. Yeah. That's pretty interesting. Whew, did the job, man. It uh, protected me. Yeah, that thing's a lot more stable. <laughs> there was a few times, yeah, I think if I was on yours, I would have probably gone down. Yeah, it's not very stable. Look at the, uh, somebody got a cow elk in here. Or maybe bull elk. Who knows? Let's have some elk legs in this parking lot. That season ended a week ago. Well, that was fun. I don't know what time it is. It's probably around 2, I'm guessing. We're gonna head on out of here, go catch up with the family. No bison out here on the refuge. Not today, December 21st. What a beautiful day. You don't get too many days like this. And the wind died down this morning. That wind was blowing good. It was cold. Died down. I mean, I'm hot. I'm sweating. Perfect. Oh, there's dice. So That's not one of them. Other people are seeing. Oh, and tap. What are you trying to grab? Got a talent. Talent. Got a talent. Oh gosh. Okay. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna go with hidden talents. Thank you. <laughs> Small. Yeah. Really art. yeah, whoever did that one, that's, that's the one. Woohoo! <laughs> what was that? I did that. <laughs> no! What? No! You guys, razors filling in while you weren't here. Well, 8% in this little can? Yeah. Well, I'm a 4% bigger one. Yeah. One? Yeah. He's trying to get me to down two. Yeah. They're small though. They're still equal to like one beer. I know. You know how much I drink, right? You had one beer. Okay, I paint the book. That's the best, that's the best part of the story. It's back. It's, 
That's here. mine. It's not mine. It's mine. Yeah, it's mine. Look, we're on the same page. Yeah. Yeah. Me with you. Yeah. <laughs> I just made a cheetah and a click on his back. Powerful oh, size. <laughs> <laughs> Halfway in. <laughs> this pecker of mine. What was that? This pecker of mine. Oh shit. Call 911. Yeah, those last three. Well, that was fun. We had some Bubba's barbecue, played a game called Hashtag, had a few drinks, had a good time, friends, family, what a good day. I mean, just a good day. A little bit of hunting, best we could for the bison, good food, good friends, good time. All the kids getting to see each other again, that's always a fun thing when we get the families back together. So uh, that was day one. We're gonna go out on day two. We're gonna go out on the ride again in the morning, check in the morning. We're gonna go back out in the afternoon. Um, evening, I would say, from two to four, check the refuge again. 